And our team coverage continues tonight. It has been a slushy Friday here in Connecticut. Some towns got rain, others got ice and snow. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Christian Colon joins us now after checking out some of those areas and has more on how crews handled the mess. Ice decorated many parts of Litchfield County. Plow truck drivers had to keep all eyes on the road to see when it was a good time to start treating them. Because of rain, everything's going to wash away. Now that we have the ice, everything sticks, nothing moves. That's when we put the material down so we know when to go out. Garrett Deacon made the call around 6 today to start salting the sidewalks. Up in Norfolk, some trees came down and a minor crash was reported due to the weather. The trees are getting very heavy with ice right now. Uh, the power is blinking occasionally here in town. Emergency crews were urging people to stay off the roads because of black ice, but even the rain was an issue, especially for basements. Check out the Litchfield Fire Department pumping out water this afternoon. Ice is really the great equalizer, so it doesn't matter what type of vehicle you're driving. So you need to give yourself some extra room and avoid any abrupt motions. Some did stay inside tonight, but Jennifer Zarens tells me her daughter stepped out quickly and this is what happened. She went outside to go to actually walk to Walgreens. As a matter of fact, when she came back, she was wet from her knees down and her pants were solid ice. And officials say if you are driving, just leave some space to those cars around you and just take it slow. In Torrington, Christian Colon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.